piss off. You order, you pay. I said... You look like you're waiting for someone. I've got time for a drink. Shayna. But you can call me Reyes. I hate code names. I was expecting someone more... Angaran. <laughs> the Resistance pays me to supply information, among other things. So you're a smuggler? Your man, Venterev, was arrested by Sloane Kelly, leader of the Outcasts. Word spread about what he did to Moshe Sefer. The people are calling for his execution. And Sloane? <laughs> She's a woman of the people. I like her already. Well, she doesn't like you. She's never met me. You work for the Initiative. Sloane was part of the uprising on the Nexus. I doubt she'll give Ven up easily. I'm taking him, with or without her permission. We're gonna be friends, you and I. There might be another way to get to Ven. You work Sloan. I'll talk to the Resistance. How do I contact you if things go south? Hey! You gotta pay! Keep the change. Always do. Have a nice chat? I think she likes me. <laughs> Don't worry. I found a workaround. Let me guess. Comes with strings attached? Not any new ones. Remember, Ephra wants Ven alive, so when you get inside, give him this. That'll eat through whatever Sloan's holding him in, and it can't be traced back to us. A resistance agent will be waiting to pick Ven up. What if he makes a run for it? It's covered. You just focus on whatever it is you need from Ven. There's a maintenance shaft around the corner, sending the access code to your Omni tool. That'll get you inside. You should be able to handle the rest. There's still the matter of the bill you left me with. I'm usually the model gentleman. I don't believe you. Because I'm lying. When you're done, come to Tartarus. First round's on me. I promise. Ryder, glad you're here. I'm sure you've heard about the murders. There's a fresh body outside Kralas. Some of the locals say it's the charlatan's handiwork. I don't buy it. The charlatan is discreet, careful. Whoever did this wanted the bodies found. Making a statement. But to who? The killer could be unhappy with how Sloane's running things. Less than a third of the victims are outcasts. No. If I was a betting man, and I am, I'd say it was the Rokar. Why would a Rokar be in Kadara port? It's Angaran built, and before Sloan, Angaran run. I think the Rokar came here looking for new recruits, and things got out of hand. And the Angara victims? How do they fit into your theory? I did some digging. All of the deceased Angara were public Milky Way sympathizers. So the victims either were from the Milky Way... ...or supported us. It's the only pattern I could find. An Angaran port run by aliens would be a prime target for their cause. Problem is, I've got no proof. And the Resistance doesn't want to antagonize the Rokar. Guessing that's where I come in. I need that fancy AI of yours to scan for evidence that could implicate the Rokar. People are scared, Ryder. This is your opportunity to win friends in Kadara Port. Looks like I'm adding detective to my growing list of titles. Detectives find things, and you're... A pathfinder. Yeah, I got it. 
One of the crime scenes isn't far. Give me a call when you get there. Got word from one of my colleagues. Venteref made it off Kadara. He's a free man. Thanks to you. You got me in. It's what I do. Things are looking less than friendly between the Collective and the Outcasts. Not everyone's happy living under Sloane's thumb. Whatever resources Kadara has goes to the Outcasts. The rest of us get scraps. The Collective claims to be different, but... It's hard to trust a faceless leader. Especially with a title like the Charlatan. <laughs> have to admit, I'm jealous. That's a better nickname than Shayna. Any idea where the Collective operates? Rumor has it they have a swanky hideout in one of the caves in Drowlir. I've never seen it myself. The mutiny on the Nexus? <laughs> I had nothing to do. With that shit show. And why do you leave? The way Tan handled things didn't exactly inspire confidence. Decided I could do better on my own. So I jumped ship with the rest of them. Ended up here. Your code name, Shayna. What's it mean? It's the Angaran word for mouth. <laughs> I'm good with. Words. Uh-huh. A regular poet. <laughs> I didn't choose it. Did you play a big part in the mutiny on the Nexus? <laughs> I had nothing to... And why So I jumped ship with the rest of them. Ended up here. How long have you worked with the Resistance? Few months. When Sloan saved Kadara Port from the Ket, Ephra wanted eyes and ears on the ground. Figured people would be more loose-lipped around their own kind. He was right. Sloane's tough, but so are the Cat. How'd she take them out? Never underestimate the element of surprise. The Cat weren't ready for an ambush. But they know her tactics now. Next time, Sloane won't be so lucky. I better get going. Ryder. Yeah? Don't take this the wrong way, but you're not really liked here in Kadara Port. Ouch. What I'm saying is, you need a friend, someone on the inside to help you out. I can be that guy. You need intel on exiles, Sloan, whatever. Come to me. Thanks, I think. Hey there. I better get going. Thanks for stopping by. Reyes should be here. I detect no sign of Mr. Vidal, Pathfinder. Shall we proceed without him? That's not... Don't move. Were we too loud? Shut up. Pharaoh will deal with you. I don't need to tell you what happens next. You're going to try to kill me and my friends. I've got a few questions first. No. You'll bleed. Just like the others. So it's true. You murdered innocent people. Invaders and sympathizers are not innocent. I will protect my home. Don't let your hate poison you. We can coexist. Like here on Kadara. Sloane lies to my people and uses them for power. I'm not Sloane. You are all the same. Not so fast. You're late. I've got a good reason. You'll see in three... Don't just stand there! Two... Kill them! Still mad?
die! The streets of Kadara are safe again. You did good, Ryder. Don't worry. I'll let all the important people know who to thank. They make a good team. Careful. I'll start thinking you like me. Let's keep this professional. I'm always professional. See you around, Pathfinder. Ryder! Perfect timing. You saved me the trouble of looking for you. You're a needy guy, Reyes. Stop being useful, and I'll stop bugging you. Uh, give me the details. A business rival, Zia Cordier, lifted cargo I was moving for a client. You want my help getting it back? We worked so well together on the row car job, I thought you'd be willing. What did she steal? No idea. Client paid extra for privacy. Considering my fees, it must be valuable. You didn't check. Honor's got a price. And the client paid it. How'd this rival of yours get hold of your cargo? Her usual tactics. Got my middleman drunk, then stole his ship. Sounds like you know from experience. Please, I keep to a three-drink maximum when I'm on a job. We cut the profits 50-50. 60-40. <laughs> Final offer. Deal. When she stops in Kadara, Zia drinks at Krala's song. We'll start there. See if Umi heard anything that could help us. You look like you're waiting for someone. That's my line. Ugh. You want a drink or a room? Information, actually. That'll cost you more than a round of drinks. My friend's good for it. I'll expect a favor in return. You're one person I'll happily owe something. Ugh. What do you want to know? Zia Cordier. She been around recently? You mean your ex? Yeah, she was here. Ex? As in girlfriend? Girlfriend's such a strong word. And we had drinks occasionally, so... <clears throat> She was here? Yeah, met with a Solarian. Shifty guy I'd never seen before. Maybe it was the charlatan. Anything's possible. You overhear their conversation? They were planning to meet someone at Sparrow's Ledge. Thanks, Umi. Whatever. You didn't hear it from me. If you check the meeting spot, I'll follow the collective lead. Doubt Zia was meeting the charlatan, but you never know. Why am I always stuck with the hard work? Because I'm the delicate one. Call me when you get to the meeting spot. It's... empty. What if this was all just some elaborate trick to get you here? You mean... there was never any cargo? Bravo. I knew you'd figure it out eventually. Zia. You could never resist a big payout. What can I say? I'm a greedy man. That's why you don't have any friends. You're selfish. She has you there. Ouch. You must be losing your touch, Reyes. I remember you being such a smooth talker. Right up until you dumped me. Don't tell me that's what this is all about. Of course not. You've been taking all the good jobs in Kadara. It's gotten more than my attention. So what? The local smuggling union got together and decided to take me down? Something like that. Ah, oh, shit. Move in. I knew I wasn't popular, but... I never thought the other smugglers would team up against me. Kind of flattering, actually. You'd be smart to keep a low profile. Discretion is my forte. Ah, all that effort and no credits to show for it. Story of my life. <laughs> you and me both. 
Hmm. I should clean up this mess. Zia was a piece of work, but it feels wrong to leave her out in the open. Hold up. This is a private event. I'm meeting a friend. Not without an invite. She's with me. Reyes Vidal. Go on in. Reyes Vidal. I was beginning to think you wouldn't show. Remember what I said about fashionably late? Shh. Introduce me to your companion. Pathfinder? Meet Kima Dorgan, the Angaran representative to Sloan, and uh, a friend. I didn't think Reyes had friends, only contacts and colleagues. Oh, I'm those as well. Who do you think secured him an invitation to this event? I was hoping he'd bring you, Pathfinder. You're all he talks about lately. Is that so? Sorry to cut this short, but I need to take care of something. Abandoning me already? It won't take long. There are important players here tonight. You should mingle, make a good impression. Don't do anything to get us kicked out, please. I won't ruin your fun. Promise. And there he goes. Any idea what he's up to? It's better not to worry about what Reyes does. Enjoy the party. Message received. Loud and clear. Just keep a low profile. Sloan's already gonna give me hell. Good to see you again, Pathfinder. I hope these pirates haven't given you a bad view of my people. <laughs> Don't worry, Ryder. I judge individuals, not groups. You, for example, I like. Not sure about who you work for, but I've learned to keep my options open. You never know who might end up in charge. Exactly. What's it mean to be an Angaran representative to Sloan? Sloan relies on me to provide an Angaran perspective. Does she listen to you? Only in extreme cases. She makes a show of being pro-Angaran, but her priority is the outcasts. She throws these parties to mollify my people. It won't work forever. How did he meet Reyes? The only way anyone meets Reyes Vidal. Through business. His skills are very valuable in Kadara Port. Are you part of the Resistance? No. Ephra and I share information, but Kadara's problems come first. If war breaks out between the Collective and the Outcasts, it will be my people who suffer. Have you seen Reyes? No, but I'm sure he'll be back soon. He likes you. I've gotten that impression. And he thinks he's so subtle. Nice talking to you, Kima. Likewise, Pathfinder. I see that Kytus needs to vet the guest list more thoroughly. I'm here with a friend. If that's a problem, I can go. Well, that would only raise questions. Enjoy Kadara's hospitality while you have it. I see that Kytus needs to vet the guest list more thoroughly. Relax, your majesty. A friend invited me. I'm only here for the drinks. You can freeload like everyone else. Don't cause trouble. Pathfinder's honor. Just go. Damn it. Why can't the serial numbers be in the same spot? 
Take the night off. Come out for a drink. Should have known you were up to something. Ryder, it's not what it looks like. So you didn't use me as a distraction to go through Sloan's stuff? <laughs> okay, yes. But it's for both our benefit. I You've promise. You've been making a lot of promises. Shit, someone's coming. We need a distraction. Oh. <clears throat> Sorry. I think we're in the clear. Maybe another kiss, just to be sure. <laughs> now you're just teasing me. <laughs> Finally, here it is. Is that what this was all about? Whiskey? The only bottle of Mount Milgram in Andromeda. Triple distilled and 645 years old. This isn't whiskey. It's treasure. I hope you're planning on sharing. Ha, <laughs> we'll see. Let's get out of here. Gorgeous, isn't it? I sometimes forget. Is Andromeda everything you hoped it would be? Every day's an adventure. Even my nights off are interesting. What about you? Why did you come here, Reyes? To be someone. That sounded surprisingly genuine, coming from you. I'm always genuine, Ryder. In my own way. Sloan's out for blood. Took your sweet time. Come on. Let's get this over with. I'm with you. You look like you're waiting for someone. Reyes? I'm here for the charlatan, not some third-rate smuggler. They're one and the same. Surprise. This whole time, you've been lying to me. Not about everything. You know who I really am. You said you wanted to settle things. How? <clears throat> A duel. You and me, right now. Winner takes Kadara Port. You want to avoid war by shooting each other? Two people shooting each other is better than a lot of people shooting each other. I'll take those terms. Sniper, his sights are set on slow. Get her out of here. Prepare the crew. Kadara port is ours tonight. Guess you got everything you wanted. What I want is peace. Sloan would have brought war to Helios. We don't have the population to survive that. Why didn't you trust me? I 
I liked the way you looked at me. I was afraid that would change. You're not the man I thought you were. I wanted to be. So what now? I get to work. Kadara port won't take itself. Thought you'd be in the throne room. Tartarus is a little shabby for Kadara's new leader, don't you think? Come on, Ryder. You know I prefer to rule from the shadows. You are a shady bastard. Guilty as charged. The Angara you met at Sloane's party, Kima Dorgan. She's agreed to be my front. And with Sloane gone, there's room for the initiative on Kadara. I'll start rounding up volunteers for an outpost. Might take a while. You exiles have a reputation. Not all of us are thieves and murderers. I am, but some of the others are perfectly nice. Perfectly? Jokes aside, I want this outpost just as much as you do. It will have my full protection. That's a promise. I allied myself with the right man. What's this? It's a handshake. We're partners now. Partners and friends. Thanks for being my plus one. I had a great time. Me too. Been a while since I had a partner in crime. How did you become the charlatan? I never set out to be the charlatan. But I couldn't openly work against Sloane. So I hired other people, representatives, to pose as me. Recruiting exiles and giving orders. The locals started calling them charlatans because they were never who they claimed to be. And the name stuck. The outcasts have scattered. That's what With Sloane and Kytis out of the picture, they're disorganized. Weak. So I jumped ship with the rest of them. Ended up here. Does the Resistance know who you really are? No. But I doubt Ephra would care. He's a results man. The secrecy around my identity isn't malicious, Ryder. It's so I can operate freely. I better get going. Thanks for stopping by. <laughs>